Hey everyone, uh, welcome back to Lucky Corners in uh, Soviet Workers' Republic and Resources. Well, it's been a few weeks since I recorded the previous episode. You know, I took a vacation, you know, that sort of thing. And, well, I don't remember exactly what I was doing, so this should be entertaining. Or not. Anyway, uh, from what I can see where I left the map pointed, you know, I've got the uh, big refinery is just you're waiting out the man hours to finish it and I've got some pipes going to and from the refinery uh, and to for the storages and that's about it and the idea there I guess uh, was to get uh, better or more fuel production right fuel and bitumen right and also to take the pollution from over here to over here. And that, I think, should be fine. But uh, I noticed something when I started this up. So if we take a look here, we have priorities, right? And output 1 is set at low priority. Now you see the one that lights up for output 1? Yeah, it's this one. And that's the one that goes up toward the power plant. Yeah, it does seem like maybe the power plant should have the high priority, doesn't it? So I'm just going to switch that to high priority. Yeah, because if we come here, output 2 um, uh, would go this way. It's not connected. Output 3 can be the lowest priority because, you know, we're just going to refine whatever oil we don't use for something else, right? Okay, so that's that. Now let's check in on the population. Uh, we'll do it for this year, and we can see that we're, we have a net gain uh, of uh, 80 or so in a month and a half, right? Uh, last year, we have a nice upward trend. So uh, just moving that pollution thing, that made all the difference if, I, if memory serves. But let's check in on the money. So we have uh, three and a quarter, three and a half million rubles owed. Uh, we uh, have uh, a few loans here, right? And the idea is to pay those off. Uh, but they're just, you know, simmering in the back here. And they can, they can keep doing that for a while. But if we take a look, and if we hover here... Uh, there's a loss, uh, a monthly loss on import over export, right? And that is partly because the uh, bitumen and fuel uh, isn't uh, accumulating right now. And that's a pretty lucrative export. So let's get the uh, map rolling here. Good. Now, um, right. So let's just check. What's this need? Not much. Okay, the pipes aren't going to be too big of a problem. Yeah, I, I don't think they are. I've got two pumps in these lines. Oh, I think it's because of the length of the, the pipes. Yeah. Uh, no, the the forwarding pumps aren't 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 a problem. Uh, they can be they can sit around doing their thing. Uh, right, so let's get out of, let's get out of underground. And here, oh yeah, that's, uh, that's making some sort of progress. So, that's good. Okay. So that will keep going. Now, up here, I've got the farming operation, right? And I'm not sure that, uh, I've got the farming operation to the point where I actually need it. Yeah, I think it's about time to build a ginormous silo and grain storage. Uh, like, I mean, a truly ginormous one uh, that we can, uh, you know, store like 10,000 you know, tons of grain, you know, as opposed to the 800 tons, right? Um, you know, I, I think that might not be the worst uh, idea uh, in the world to have one of those. 
And then I can connect it to the rail network. Um, yeah. Uh, or something, yeah. Uh, I see also the, oh, the, right, that's done. This stuff is all built, right? Oh, I was waiting for workforce, right, yes. Because uh, that will be quite lucrative to export coal as well. Uh, so, yeah, that will be... That would be quite good. Meanwhile, over here, uh, that's actually making decent progress. What if I just allow more workers just to stroll up there? Yeah, that's... Well, we've got all the cranes, so it's so the workers we do have strolling up there are making real progress on things, so, so that's good. Oh, we got people coming out of here. Oh, okay. Right, yes. I'm using the leapfrogging uh, gimmickry there. Right. Okay, that will be fine. Um, oh, and uh, winter has passed. So, that's good. Yeah, I need to get uh, quite a substantial uh, income going uh, fairly quickly here uh, so that the uh, electronics import doesn't bankrupt the uh, the Republic. Uh, so uh, I should probably be looking at what do I need to do to make electronics? That occurs to me to be the thing to start investigating. Yeah. So... Right, so let's just take a look uh, while that stuff just builds in the background there. So our miscellaneous industry is not it. Uh, advanced industry. So, electronics assembly. Um, right, Ele electrical components. Okay, so... So it takes uh, electronic components. And mechanical components and plastics. So mechanical components. And oh, OK, so I need one of those one of those and one of those to make everything work and a plastics factory which is a petrochemical one so that's a chemical plant so it takes crops gravel wood and oil okay so i think realistically I, I'm going to need to be starting... I can import the plastics, though. Yeah, I think I can import the plastics. Uh, let's just uh, take a look here. Uh, we have... No, it's in here. Uh, so, prices. So, uh, electronic components are uh, 58.55. Right, I'm going to make a note of that. 58.55. Aha. Uh -huh. And mechanical components are 17.10. Right. Okay. And plastics are 2810. Uh, right, okay. And electronics. Um, yeah, here. Uh, electronics are 60 or are 7K. Okay, so I'm not going to be making money importing the, okay, 
Now, um, uh, chemicals are, yeah, they're expensive as well. Uh, so let's just take a look again in the advanced industries. So electronics assembly, uh, we're using 1.8 and 1.8 to 3.6. Okay, so it's, uh, let me get a calculator out wherever I put the calculator that I have on my desk. Um, I have no idea where I put it. Oh, there it is. Staring me in the face, right? So, if I need, I need 1.8 at 5855. And I need 1710. at 1.8 uh, and 2810 times it was uh, 2.7 and that produces 3.6 so I get 5890 per um, yeah that's a major loss so uh, I'm better off to just uh, just import it at the moment. Uh, I'd have to build it from the raw materials all the way up to make any <clears throat> any inroads on that. Uh, that won't be the case later on, though. Uh, so uh, here, um, without drinking water, ah, I do not have water infrastructure up here. Yes. Uh, do I have, I have a sewer connection, but not a water connection. Okay. Where am I going to get a water connection from? Well, that's a little bit of a challenge, isn't it? Um, okay, over here. I have a big pump, which brings water up to a switch here. Oh, I've got a switch here. Water substation. Ah, okay. Um, I could come off of that one. Okay, so if I go up here and I build a water... substation I can put it right I don't know here yeah I can put a water substation right there and then I can go and grab a pipe um um medium pipe is probably fine and that can come down to here. Yeah, I can. Right. Okay. So I build that. Yeah. And I go over here. No, I go over here and I build, build that. Now, oh, come on. Build that and that. And then, okay. So that'll get a water supply up there. Uh, meanwhile, the uh, other pipes and everything will are waiting for stuff. I see. Uh, wait, is that, that's not even assigned, is it? No, it is. Yeah. Okay. Right. This. Okay, we just need workers to turn up there. Yeah, that 
that that's definitely a thing that's needed workers to turn up there um but we'll be able to soak up a fair bit of uh, workers here and we'll be able to run the oil field at maximum production so uh, i think that will be uh, beneficial um right Well, that water pipe is getting built. Is it that we don't have any workers at the platform this guy's picking up from? No, we have workers there. Okay. We're going to go up here and assign... Make sure everybody's assigned. Uh, something that will bring workers. <clears throat> Why are you not... Well, stupid thing is, no, wait, do we not, okay, we have fuel, why aren't they going anywhere? Okay. No. I guess we're waiting for stuff. Yeah, we're waiting for stuff on a lot of these. Okay. Yeah, I think it's a stuff thing. Uh, right, okay. Where are you? Okay, that one's just waiting for workers now. Okay, we should get buses. Uh, but why are no workers turning up on this? Okay, can we call everybody home? Um, yeah, that's a that's a question. Why isn't that working? Okay. I should actually shut that off until there's actually uh, resources coming in there. That might not be a terrible idea either. Um... Okay, those aren't assigned for some reason. Okay. Assign. Yeah. Well, that will probably help. Yeah. Why wasn't it assigning it? Uh, go in here. In here. What? Assign construction office mode. Okay. Okay, well that was interesting. Uh, that must have burned down at some point and got out of the assignment. Okay, that would make... Um, uh, that would make some sense, I think. Okay. I do wish when buildings are replaced, they'd uh, regain their connections immediately. Uh, so you didn't have to redo them. Uh, you know, I, I wish that would happen, but uh, it obviously doesn't. Okay. 
Now I can go ahead and add that. And that is, uh, that has the labor. Yep. Okay. So that's going to bring the water up there and the, we're building this, right? Yeah. And the pipes are going to get built. Yeah. And then export on this stuff should ramp up. I just have to turn this back on. Yeah, because this um, this has power, right? Yeah, it does. Okay. Okay, that's a that's an output pipe. Okay, this is set to yeah. And this, oh yeah, it's waiting for stuff. Right. Okay. Oh, look, we have uh, buses arriving. Um, so that's building this pipe, right? Yep. So that should actually finish that pipe if I've got my timing right. Yeah, if I do. Um, and this. Yeah, okay. Oh, right. I want to check something here. Um, no. Advanced. Um, mechanical components needs... Steel. Just steel. Okay. That'll be my next uh, industry project. Yeah. Although, yeah, I, I probably should work on okay, I have a bauxite processing plant with no workers, right? Okay, right. So I'll, I'll sort that out at another time, uh, right? Uh, I just want to check the population this year. Yeah, it's still going up. Okay. And now oh, we've got most of the output pipes are complete. And this. Ah. And the water supply is sorted out. Yeah. Okay, good. Now, okay, the output. The output pipes are actually just about complete here. Yep, yeah, okay. So we need this one. Yeah. And is this one assigned? Oh, it, I didn't assign it. Okay. Now it is. Okay. So that should get the refinery running. All right, this is, all oh right, yeah, that is done. <clears throat> yep. And then two more pipes. And then, then everything is uh, just, um, it just t it'll just tick along, right? Uh, so this one, um, all related vehicles. Let's take a look at this <clears throat> here. We're gonna make everybody get out when I, they get up there. That means they'll hang out at the at the bus stop, and then they'll be able to, uh, you know, staff stuff up here, uh, right?
Oh, I need to not uh, load there. Yeah. Um, here. Don't load. Yeah. Yeah, don't take the passengers back. Just leave them there. Yeah. Okay. Now, down here, uh, this pipe is done and done. And we're filling up with, uh, with oil. Excellent. Uh, this is going down. Now it's going back up. All right. Now we can add workers here. Right. And this will kick into gear and start producing stuff. Yes. Okay. It is now producing stuff. Which means this stuff is filling up. Yes. So it'll take a minute for that to, to happen. Meanwhile, the oil uh, field here should be running at full bore. Yeah, looks like it is. Yep, so it's running at full bore, and that's what we want it to do. And this, yeah, this is going to drain. I think. When this uh, gets really going. But we're producing... Uh, we're producing some useful amount of stuff. Uh, bitumen export is what's likely going to uh, kick off first. Uh, because we don't use it mostly, right? Uh, this is still full that's still going and yeah okay this is good yeah definitely good now we have some unemployed people but not really enough yet to kick this into operation but um i do think uh, do I have a loco here? Okay, so I'm going to need to buy some rail rolling stock, and I'm going to need a loco that uh, that can run on here. So I want a diesel loco um, value. Uh, that runs at 100k... Um, you know what? For a shunter, you know, fetch stuff from the border, that's probably fine. So let's buy one of those. Um, right, now you, you'll go there. And then, okay, now... I need to go up here, and I need to you know, buy a vehicle up here, and it's going to be Metro, right? Now, uh, that carries 525, 525, 525, 664, and 189. Do I want to go with the 189 one, or the... It's cheaper. Or do I want to go with the big one? Yeah. That's a question. Uh, I used the Metro ECS in a uh, uh, private game. Um, see, these are all exactly equivalent. Uh, that one, uh, 
you know, I think it's maybe. Huh. One of these, you know what? It's going to be one of those. Yeah. Okay, now you are going to... Uh, you are going to go to uh, here. And you're going to load. And then you're going to go to here. And you're going to... And then you're going to go back to here. What? Really? Okay. We're going to load. Yeah. And we're going to go here. And we're going to do nothing at the train depot down there. Okay. So if we start that, do we actually fetch anything? That's the question. So we come in here. And we do fetch it. Yep. And then we go down here. Okay. Let's follow it. Okay. Close that. Yep. And we're going for gas, are we? Yep. We're going for gas. And then we go back out and we drive. Well, it didn't get stuck getting gas. That's a good sign. And then we come down to where we're going to drop the metro off. And we have dropped the metro off. Yes. Okay. Now we can close that. Look in here. We've got a metro train, right? Uh, so I could start running the metro uh, back and forth here. Now, um, this is all disabled currently. Um, yeah, it is. But... Right. Well, first of all, I'm going to go in here and grab this and new stop here and here. Right? Yeah. Yeah, it should be able to go back and forth there. So, um, right. So we're going to go in here and we're going to call this Metro Line 1. Why? Because it's a totally uncreative name. That's why. Now, if I close this and I close this, what happens if I... Right, so... Yeah, because it's built all of the track up to here. So, yeah, the track builders won't get in the way. So, start. Uh, what's it doing? And off it goes here. Comes in here. Does a thing. And then it makes a U-turn. Right. Just watching it to make sure it can actually make it between the uh, stops here. So it comes across, gets to the stop, yep, and then it makes a U turn on stilts. Yeah. That looks like it's going to work. Okay. 
So, now all I need to do is turn on workers. And we'll see what happens. See here, we have picked up nine workers. Okay, now we're collecting workers there, and we'll see what happens. Uh, so we're collecting a lot of workers down there. Might need a second train on that just to uh, get the workers not to time out there. But okay, so we're coming out of there, and we're going where? Are we going all the way to the mine? I think we're going all the way to the mine. Yeah. So we can get to the mine at least. Yep. And what can we reach from here? Uh, we can reach one of the... We can reach like none of these guys. Neither of these guys. Um, can we? No, we can't. Okay, so I'm going to need to, um, oh, I can do this. Okay, so you can come out like this, and you can come out like this, and can I get you, yeah, I can get you to come out like that. Okay, so if I build those, okay. Now, oh, right, I need you, I need uh, you. Okay, so that should be enough to get these in range of here. And realistically, I probably want to build uh, this. Can I get it under on this side? Uh, don't, uh, no, not there. No, apparently not. But I could come across like this and like this. Uh, yeah. Well, I could do that, yeah. You, you. Right, okay, so that's going to go back and forth. We are, ah, we're filling up with the uh, coal ore. Yeah, so that's good. Uh I think I've got enough workers to make that work. Uh, we're going to sh end up shorting here. But we are exporting bitumen again, or, or fuel, uh, or some of some kind. No. Is that an export, or is that just a fuel up the... Oh, that's an export. Okay, we're exporting. Yay! Yay! Now, down here, we just need some of these things to build, right? And then we'll start sending workers to these guys, which will then start filling up this guy. And then I can, aha, and I'll be able to start exporting coal at a profit, right? Uh, which will be good. Okay, so we're going to get this guy. We'll start operating first. Uh-huh. Right. So this is something that's been building for, uh, what, 30 parts, uh, and now it's, uh, now it's operational. Uh, in comes the train. Yep, in comes the train. And whoosh, there we go. And 
we are producing and now we are filling yes good we now have a coal industry I like this okay and that's going to build pretty quick so uh, I can now I can now start exporting coal but also where's the heating plant um, right I can now start getting my coal locally so I can go for my line here um, view this uh, we're gonna add you where we're going to load coal right and we're going to go here and remove that stop and we're going to accept the changes yes because we might as well get the coal from uh locally right now what else do we need coal for it's here right yes so if we go in here uh cement coal right uh if we go in here and we add a stop down here right load coal yeah and then we go here and Right, okay, and we take that out. Yeah, okay. Save that. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna take our locally produced coal into here. And also we need coal here, right? So need to modify this. Uh-huh. You come down here, bang. No, uh, now we come down here, go there, go here, take that out, and we will load coal there. Yep, save it. Yep, what else needs coal? Do you? No. No, I think that's all of the coal we we need to distribute. I think it is. Uh, no, wait. Do, am I producing steel anywhere? I don't think I am. No, I don't have iron, right? Yeah. So, yeah, we stop importing coal. That'll save us a little bit on import costs, right? Because here, this is filling up. So I can actually export coal as well. Uh, so I can put a coal export train on. Uh, but let's, uh, let's take a look here. No, we'll take a look here. So import, Soviet bloc. Uh, last month, we imported 4K worth of coal. Uh, this month, we're importing no coal, right? Yeah. So this, uh, yeah. Okay, good. That's, uh, that's a coal industry, finally. Uh, right. Now I could actually run a, well, can I actually? run a conveyor straight into the heating plant. Um, right, so if I, if I grab one of these, can I get one into the, no, I've got stuff in the way. Oh. I can actually conveyor it straight in. Neat. 
Well, I'm not going to. A truck is uh, sufficient supply for that. Okay, so our refined coal is full. These guys are full. And this guy is filling up. And yeah, that fills up and then I'll have plenty of coal that I can export. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. So now uh, we've got a net um, positive uh, on the exports here, right? So let's uh, let's take a look in here. No, nope, it's in here. Um, exports. Soviet block. So we're exporting last month. We exported 160k in bitumen uh, and 30k in fuel. Uh, so that's uh, that's quite uh, good. This month uh, we're half through. And we're exporting bitumen still, uh, so that's good. Uh, so yeah, we're we're doing much better now. Uh, fires are happening and going away. That's fine. Right. And how's this guy doing? Yeah. So this guy is doing less business because now we've siphoned off workers to come down here, right? And that is perfectly fine. Uh, actually, I want to see here. Yeah. Uh, that finishes. Yeah. Okay. Right. Anyways. Um, good. So the uh, the plan here is I'm going to end up running a uh, a train. To export coal and I think it'll be one train and it'll just run back and forth but I you know I probably should build a rail distribution office of some description yeah okay so that's gonna be under train distribution office I could stick it in I could stick one in right here. Yeah, I could. I can't fit it. I can fit it here, but no, that. I could fit it here. I could squeeze it all the way back here. Yeah, I'm going to fit it there. Okay. Well, if I'm going to do that, I'm going to need to do that. Hmm. <clears throat> right? and build that yeah and i'm going to need um and i'm going to need one of these right it's going to need to come up like like this and do i just need to connect the one I might just need to connect the one. Okay. Now, you... Go build that. Okay. Um, should be all it needs to build. And then I'll, I'll uh, get fuel into it. So that uh, it does, the trains coming out of there don't need to go into here. Yeah. So that's that. Then I'll just need to put a signal here. Yeah, I'll just need to put a signal there. Yeah, that's... Uh, that's that. Okay. We have the connection to the uh, train distribution office. Right. And that's going to take a little bit of material, but not crazy amounts. Yeah. Oh, while I'm uh, in here, 
mixed. Yeah. Actually, maybe I don't need a signal there. Yeah, maybe I don't. I can just leave it the way it is, because I'm not going to have conflicts coming out of here very often. So, yeah, that should be fine. And this is... Yeah, okay. Well, uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to put the cut here. And then next time, uh, I this should finish next time, uh, the fun bit will be uh, fueling it up and uh, loading it with uh, a train, you know, an, um, an, a diesel engine and uh, and uh, uh, hopper cars and doing coal export. And then this number should start going up quite a lot faster. I want to use the uh, distribution office because then I can set it so that it doesn't completely wipe out the coal supply. Right, so when the coal supply gets to 95%, send a train, load the train, head, head over to customs, export it, and be done with it. Then as the coal usage goes up, it'll do that less often, right? Until it doesn't do it, right? Uh, anyway, uh, that's going to be the cut point. So uh, on the way out, I'll just mention that I have a Patreon, which if for some bizarre reason you want to support the channel, well, you can. Uh, if not, uh, well... Yeah, then don't. The link will be in the description either way. And all that said, see you back next time.